I thought today uh, went really well. I, the first half, uh, just thinking about it, when I went into halftime, I thought that we, um, I thought that we were playing hard, but it w we were a little hesitant because we're still not um, completely used to each other because it's such a new group. And I told them, you know, we were about 75% um, with our effort. And I thought that they needed to just let loose and play. And we'll figure it out from there. And I thought in the second half, we played with a lot more force and energy. And uh, we were able to extend our lead a little bit. Um, second half, you look at it, a lot of guys got in. We had four or five guys in double figures, I want to say. Um, Trezari and White played well coming off the bench. We had 22 assists on 28 made field goals. Um, that was really good. We were able to shake loose a little bit in transition. So uh, overall, I thought we played a really good game. Um, still have a lot of improvement to do. Um, and I'm looking forward to going into this week, getting ready for Illinois State. Playing a lot of guys, how much was that? Just the, the second half, kind of, you, you built a comfortable lead. How much was it you, you're still trying to figure out what you have in, in, in the guys? I'm still trying to figure out what we have, and I'm trying to get it down to about eight or nine guys. Um, all, of our, all of the people on our team can play. Um, I'm just trying to get guys to, uh, that's playing in the game to impact winning in different ways than scoring. Uh, so I'm still trying to figure out my lineups, um, you know, my rotations, who I like with who in the game. So uh, it didn't have anything to do with the lead. I wanted to make sure everybody played, um, but I'm still trying to figure this group out. Jalen Sims obviously had a good night for you, a veteran guy for you. Uh, one of your returning guys from last year. What has he worked on the most coming into this year? What do you see from him tonight? Just becoming a better basketball player. You know, that was our challenge to him. Becoming a better basketball player with his IQ and uh, competing more on the defensive end, being more of a two-way player. Tonight, I thought he was really aggressive from the start with his offense. I thought he competed defensively. Uh, still made some errors, but I thought he took a step forward in that area. Um, I thought he played a really good game. Probably the most comfortable was shy at the point, but what do you see from the other point guards tonight? Uh, Jamari Thomas, um, you know, we, we've been on him a lot. We give him a lot of tough love, uh, but he's improving. He's improving. We're challenging him on a defensive end. Uh, he gets lost a little bit, but he, he I thought tonight he played better. Uh, offensively, he's gifted. You know, he can get to the paint. He's a really gifted passer, um, a really good offensive player. Uh, so we challenged him on the defensive end. I was I was pleased with his effort tonight. You look around Trask and you, you actually see a few fans this time. What does that feel like? What did the guys say after the game? What did you have to tell them anything before the game? To kind of get used to playing in front of fans again. No, no, you know I just told him, uh, Jeremy. I just told him to just embrace it. Um, I didn't know what the crowd was going to look like. I knew we'd I knew we'd have a a pretty decent crowd, but don't take it for granted. Give the fans something to come back and watch. Um, and I think we did that. You know, we always talk about putting a good product out on the floor for our fans to enjoy watching us play. And I think we did that. Um, so I didn't talk to them after the game about it. I'm sure we'll talk about it tomorrow or Saturday. But I think they enjoyed it. You hit the road to uh, Illinois State. Uh, what do you need to do before then? And uh, what's it like going on the road with a group of young guys? Um, I don't know that for sure, uh, what we need to work on. I know one thing, uh, I know we need to continue to improve defensively. Um, that's always going to be the case. So I need to watch the film and see what we need to attack going into the week. Um, but I'm looking forward to getting better and going up to Illinois State to win the game.